how may I help you? Many areas now require installation of amalgam separators on dental office waste lines. In many cases, it's a simple installation that anyone can do. We'd like to show you how to install a system that is cost-effective and simple to maintain. American Dental offers several amalgam separators which meet or exceed the ISO 11143 standards and are at or above 99% efficiency for removing amalgam from the dental waste stream. Speak with one of our technicians or check out our recent Tech Tips newsletter to help you choose the right amalgam separator for you. The link is in the video description. For this video, we'll show you how to install the popular ASDEX AS9 chairside amalgam separation system. The AS9 amalgam separation system consists of a collection separation filter, manifold assembly, mounting bracket, and hardware. The unit operates under vacuum and is to be installed in line on the central vacuum line. The manifold has pipe thread fittings, but may also be connected via flexible vacuum line if fitted with the provided barb connectors. Give us a call if you have questions about where to install this unit. If you have a cuspidor, you'll also need to install a cuspidor vacuum drain kit. Please speak to one of our technicians for more information. We've decided to install our separator on a wall where the flexible vacuum line comes into the room, so we'll use the provided barb connectors. We want to mount the separator vertically, and with sufficient clearance beneath so that you can change the filter. Also, installation should be kept simple. Avoid 90 degree turns and excess adapter hose lengths. This way you'll be able to maintain good vacuum levels. We'll split the flexible vacuum tubing where we want to mount the manifold bracket. We'll grab the manifold mounting bracket and use it to mark the wall with the bracket screw hole pattern. We'll then drill where we mark to make it easier to screw in the bracket attachment screws. It's now time to attach the manifold mounting bracket to the wall. The manifold assembly is shipped with a tie wrap around its body to keep the stainless steel filter retaining bracket in place. Cut the tie wrap and discard it. Go ahead and mount the manifold with the provided hardware. Because we're installing into flexible vacuum tubing, we'll use the provided tubing barb adapters to connect the tubing we spliced earlier. Now grab the separation filter and remove the inlet and outlet screw on caps. Keep the caps in a safe spot as you'll need them to dispose of the filter. Align up the inlet and outlet ports on the collection separation filter to the inlet and outlet ports on the manifold and push the filter into place. Turn the retaining knob clockwise to seat the filter snugly. Finally, observing the flow direction arrow on the manifold, connect the flexible vacuum hose you splice to the barb connectors and you're finished. To replace the filter, simply loosen the knob on the retaining bracket and pull the filter assembly away from the manifold. Remember to replace the screw-on cap she saved. 